Well, today is an exciting day for me in this project. Um, I've been working on this for a couple weeks and uh, on and off and mostly on the weekends because that's when I have time. But uh, today is an exciting day because it's the first day that I can make this machine move. And uh, to demonstrate that, I'm going to uh, make the x-axis motor, which I've uh, disconnected the belt, I'm going to make that move in this test. Um, my motion control solution uh, consists of an Arduino Uno running the Gerbil software that was uh, developed. It's open source. Um, and right now I've kind of got a hacked solution um, with uh, uh, pins uh, running into the uh, wires and coming in through the open end of a DB5 or DB25 connector and going to the Pololu motion control board and they're hooked up to the pins to move the x-axis. Um, in addition I've got the uh, 5 volt motor enable uh, hooked up to the right pin as well so that motors will actually move. Um, the board and the software do have a motor enable pin uh, but I haven't uh, gotten that far in working with it yet. So um, right now it's hooked up to the computer but my full solution will use another Arduino Omega to read G-code off of a um, SD card and feed it, feed it via serial communication to this board and this will execute the three axis motion solution. Um, so right now it's set up uh, to communicate through a uh, serial uh, communication window and so if I go ahead and put in a uh, G1X100 it will um, move the, solution, the motor. So there you go, it gives me an OK X100 and you can see that the motor is actually turning um, at a constant rate and it will uh, accelerate to a stop and there you go and that's it. That means it works. Um, everybody out there, we can use uh, an Arduino for motion control and uh, it works pretty well. So uh, I guess next up I'll have um, a solution when the whole system is moving. So I gotta order some more parts, but it'll work.